every patient is different as far as when it comes to recovery. And recovering from, say, a, a, a minimally invasive decompression is different than recovering from a, a open deformity operation. But say somebody needs an open deformity operation, we're going to do the right surgery for them. And so every procedure is tailored to the patient, to everything that they might need. So the degree of decompression of any neural elements, decompression of the nerve, uh, to uh, performing a fusion, to doing deformity correction, and maneuvers such as osteotomies to correct deformity, that's going to be tailored to each individual patient. Um, but we try and get all patients through the hospital experience with the least amount of pain, uh, with the fastest recovery as possible, because our ultimate my goal is to get patients back to recovery. Um, everyone is a little bit different, and we try and do things as minimally invasive as can possibly be done, and we're going to choose the right procedure for each individual patient. Spinal deformity surgery uh, should be performed by a surgeon who specialized in complex spine surgery and adult spinal deformity, and when we're talking about treatment of adults. And so that, that involves doing post-residency fellowship training after completion of residency and then having great experience with treating uh, adults with spinal deformity. Jefferson is able to provide the full gamut of care that's required in, a, in spinal deformity surgery. Um, unlike uh, smaller institutions, having the big institution with all of the resources is really necessary in order to have excellent outcomes following spinal deformity surgery. And so it's not just me, the surgeon. It's also about the neuroanesthesiologists and the neuromonitoring team and the, and the subspecialized nurses in the OR and, and the recovery room nurses that see spinal deformity patients day in and day out. And then we have our own spine unit. Those are uh, a unit that's dedicated to just spinal, uh, so spine patients and spinal deformities patients with physical therapists and, every, and rehab physicians, everyone that is well-versed in, in, in taking care of spinal deformity patients. And so although technically doing the procedure can be done at a smaller institution, having all the resources really is what makes the difference. And so that's why I personally chose to come to Jefferson is that, that all these resources would be here for me and for my patients to have the best possible outcomes. I'm Dr. Joshua Heller. My mission at Jefferson is to improve lives.